Hi, hello, I'm Yoande Akiola, and it's such a pleasure to be part of this incredible, inspiring Changemakers Summit. Um, I love the idea of change makers, um, especially in these unprecedented times where, where it feels, you know, like we could do with <laughs> we could do with change, we could do with a much better world, we could do with people who are right at the heart of helping us understand how to treat our planet much better. Um, we could do with um, change makers helping us understand that we're all connected, irrespective of our different backgrounds um, and our different cultures and our different religions. When I was thinking of the summit um, and, and thinking of um, what I might also share with you, um, I asked myself the question, what is a change maker? Um, I'm not exactly sure I uh, found that one answer, but then I, without a doubt, um, share the opinion that a change maker is somebody who sees the opportunity to improve the lives of many. Somebody who sees that things need to improve, whether it's in quality of life or it's in, you know, how we live our lives, how um, organisations um, have an impact of, on, on the world. Somebody who is also brave enough to speak up when they see something that's not right and not helpful to our world. Somebody who is happy to stick their necks out <laughs> and to start to come up with creative solutions um, to help improve our quality of life and the way we do things in our world. Um, I was I was thinking, you know, of what careers those would be, but then I actually got to a point where I thought, you know what, every single career out there every career that has a direct impact on people's lives, on our planet's well-being, is in line to making change. It's aligned to making change. It's aligned to making improvements. Um, whether it's engineering, whether it's journalism, whether it's architecture, whether it's, you know, medicine, whether it's um, you know, the study of space, um, whether it's aeronautical engineering, it all has a direct impact on our lives and, and on the planet um, and is therefore um, an opportunity to bring about the change that our world needs to see. I didn't always know what I wanted to become. In fact, for a very long time, I imagined I was going to be lots of things. I wanted to become an architect. That was probably my longest running ambition. Um, at one point, I wanted to become an archaeologist. Um, at one point, I wanted to become a fashion designer. Um, I was really into books at one point, um, and I wanted to become a writer. Um, I ended up becoming an engineer. Um, but you know what? I didn't realise how diverse and how connected lots of different disciplines were until I got into engineering and became an engineer. The one question lots of people ask me is, how do I go about finding my purpose in something? Um, and my answer to that question is, that is what makes a change maker. Finding your purpose in something so that you have a direct impact on the lives of your loved ones, of people that you'd never meet, is the process of becoming a change maker. Um, and these challenging but very exciting times all of us are on a journey. All of us are constantly rethinking what it is that we want to do, what it is we think we find our purpose in um, to align, to change making, to align, to problem solving, to align, to creativity.
Now, so I would say today is an incredible opportunity to listen to all the different and wonderful speakers that are going to be speaking, all the exciting content that's going to be available to you and for you to listen to them and start to think about what you're interested in, what you're passionate about, what you think, you know what, I would be quite happy doing this for a very long time or maybe not a very long time. When I was your age, I thought architecture was going to be my thing because I saw an immediate need for better living conditions um, in my immediate environment. And so I wanted to design buildings that would provide more comfortable living conditions for my loved ones, for people around me. Um, not long before I um, started to think about universities, actually, I think I was already thinking about universities. My mom suggested to me that I considered engineering. Um, she said, you know what, engineering has all these different options. You can go into power, you can go into water engineering, you can go into transport. Um, you can consider um, space, you can consider aeronautical engineering. And I thought to myself, oh my goodness, like literally, why are you coming to talk to me about engineering now? Isn't it a bit too late? Um, I am glad um, that I explored it because I thought I was, you know, hung up sure. I thought I was sure about what I wanted to become at that point. Um, but then I considered it. I considered, um, you know, the opportunities that were um, available in a very varied um, career option. Um, and I have zero regrets today. In 2020, our world is extremely connected. The fact that you can come up with a solution in this country and see it applied in other parts of the world is what I think is going to make the role of a change maker extremely exciting. Um, I started off in engineering. Um, I did a degree in engineering um, and have worked um, in engineering. I still work as an engineer. Um, but along the way, I've picked up international development. Um, I've picked up presenting uh, TV programs for the likes of Discovery Channel, the Science Channel. Um, and I think things like that, you know, trends like that is what we are starting to see. Um, trends like that, people with lots of different skills, lots of different in just, uh, interest combined, um, I think would form the heart of what a change maker um, is in a few years. Um, the fact that you would not be restricted as well, you know, um, to a certain extent, um, technology is going to liberate people to be extremely creative, to be problem solvers, to be innovators and inventors. Um, and people are going to make the most of it. People are going to see a solution and not feel that they can't come up with um, people are going to see problems and not feel that they can't come up with the solutions to um, those problems. Um, and that's very, very exciting. So if I can leave you with um, a few things, um, change making is exciting. Change making is about purpose. Um, change making is about creativity and pushing the boundaries on, 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 on problem solving. Um, change making is being brave to call out things that are not good for our planet, call out things that are not safe for our people. Um, change making is about really thinking about the betterment of the human race. Um, I hope you enjoy the rest of um, the summit. I'm going to be watching and absorbing all of the sessions um, and all of the talks. Um, exciting times are here um, and our world needs you.